This work is finally giving me a tool to practice everything I've learned for the last 15, 20 years. I just want to scream from the mountaintops how incredible it is. It's been so interesting to watch this grow into such a movement. And I just ask myself, why is it growing so much? Like, I think the mental part of myself wants to understand, like, why are people so intrigued? Mm. Specifically when it comes, you look at something like our YouTube right now, where mm. it's like, we have almost, we have over half a million subscribers on YouTube, which is just, my mind doesn't even, fa can't even fathom that many people, yeah. but are clicking subscribe because there there's a felt sensation that they want to know more about it. And I'm like, what is that that is making them want to learn more or to like, what what is it that they're feeling a relation to? I didn't even actually want to come to this. <laughs> when my partner asked me to go, I said, sure but had no idea, no idea what I was signing up for. <laughs> and as I look around the room right now, I feel an incredibly powerful sense of energy that I have been truly longing for, let's say. This experience, I truly believe could literally and will literally change the world. Thinking of my five-year-old daughter who I did not want to leave for four day, five nights. <laughs> I know going home, I'm going to be a better mother. I know I will be a better partner. And I damn well know I will be a better facilitator in what I do. And I would really suggest to anyone that sees one of those videos like I saw online or gets called to go, just go sit in on a, a session, be open to it because this is something that if we could teach this practice, this somatic breathwork practice to parents of children, to teachers, to the world, we would actually be practicing better self-care and really truly showing up as ourselves. So I am making a commitment to this community here, to this village, that I'm going to do any and everything that I can with my partner to blast the shit out of this. <laughs> Pardon my French. To bring this to the world. <laughs> Thank you. I heard Jim Carrey say it right, really, really well. You know, he says that we all think that we are human experiencing the universe, but we are the universe experiencing humanness. And I think that's really what it is. I think there is a bold connection between all of us, even for those who don't know what they're watching on our content. Yeah. Two humans together like so intimately intertwined that you would probably only see that in the cinema mm -hmm. other than actually real life on social media. Surely not. Yeah. But you have two humans that are interacting and they're not mirroring each other per se. One is being so responsible to the other and the other is actually fully in their vulnerability and their expression. Yeah. And on top of that, that connects you to something deeper, more intrinsic, more innate, more primal. It transcends all language that we would know verbal language and moves to the body language. I didn't even realize how disassociated from my body I had become. It was just the way that I was living. I spent the last decade of my life living in a trauma response. And when I got into this work five years ago, it was very self-development, thought work driven, um, very in the mind. And that got me to a point. And this past year, I had a realization that what got me here won't get me there. And I could feel a block 
and it was like I thought thought work would work and I could think my way out of it and, and I could live in the mind so much and I didn't even know what I was missing. I feel like I found the missing link. And yesterday in the session, I was able to access memories that I have been asking for for years. And I feel like now I'm going to be able to serve in such a greater capacity because I'm going to be able to give it to myself. So thank you for that. This is going to change the entire way that I show up for me and the way that I do the work and the way that I serve in the world. So thank you. And just the second lasting impression that this left on me that I want to share is I've been in a lot of different certifications um, or containers. And it's very special when you find leaders who lead driven by a mission and I can feel the movement that you guys are creating and I can feel that it's creating itself. And the way that you all show up, every single one of you, uh, Jaggers, Fish, and the rest of the team, and who you magnetize to you, I can feel the depth in which you are serving from a place not to get, but to give. And it's palpable. So thank you. I'm a therapist and and I'm not meaning this in a braggy way, I promise. It's really a validating way that I have my PhD in somatic psychology and have um, wrote my dissertation on catharsis and emotional expression and the role of relationship and full emotional expression and all about window of tolerance and how it's so misunderstood that hyper arousal somehow is unsafe. And so my point is I, this work is finally giving me a tool to to practice everything I've learned for the last 15, 20 years. And I, I just want to scream from the mountaintops how incredible it is. You know, I've tried yoga therapy and bioenergetics and all of Lowen's work and somatic experiencing and like everything. And this is enabling me to actually practice with my clients everything I've learned and I'm so grateful. So I just wanted to share that. Our content, in my opinion, speaks to a universal language. Mm. Emotion, somatics, caretaking. And I think that, I think that that words not aren't always the most powerful thing, and yet they are the thing we use the most. Especially, I've mentioned this in the English language, yeah. but there's something about that content that speaks so much more than just words. Yeah, and can touch everyone. If you want to experience the power of somatic breath work, we would love to see you at one of our community sessions. You can click the link below to figure out when our next session is, and we'd love to see you there. This experience, I truly believe, could literally and will literally change the world.